everyone and welcome back to Heart and Soul Homes. Today I am all about food prepping. I'm going to get ready my fruit for the week, my smoothie boxes, and I'm going to juice some uh, celery juice to go into our uh, smoothies. So let's get started. First what I need to do is wash my fruit. What I use for that is just a veggie, a fruit and veggie clean that I get in the grocery store in the produce. Um, I use this little strainer. It just goes right over my sink and I just get to washing. So let's go. I can hear music all louder. Stop going down while we ride. Okay, so I've got all my fruit washed and ready to go. So now what I'm gonna do is I have these great containers. I got these on Amazon. They have the uh, great thing here that keeps the fruit fresher longer, uh, dividers, and then a great cap. If you can see, it has little air pockets. So it kind of lets in the air and it, it helps to keep your fruit last longer. Fruit in our house doesn't typically last a whole lot of time, so, but it is great anyhow because I love the fact that if it does wait a little bit, it's okay. So I think what I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna try to get all of my blackberries in this container. So let's do it. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and cut up my strawberries. Um, if you can see here, I've got this great cutting board. Again, I got this on Amazon. It has, it's the wood uh, board and then it has a different pullout for each type of, you know, fish, uh, steak, fruit. So let's get going. So bang on the door, step to the floor. Stir it up now, right till the morning comes. We're gonna bang that drum. Drop in the beat, all that we need. Turn it up now, right till the morning comes. We're gonna bang that drum. Like stardust, no one like us, babe. We be glorious, and you can try hating or shaming. There'll be no bowing or taming. Nothing like us. Okay, so my next project is going to be juicing the celery. Now I buy this celery at Costco. It's already, it's organic, and it's already cut up, ready for me to juice. So it just makes it a little bit easier, and it's pretty inexpensive. A bag like this is like four dollars, I think. So it's not that bad uh, expense wise. And I get this at Costco. Let's do it. We be glorious. So bang on the door, step to the floor. Stir it up now, right till the morning comes. We're gonna bang that drum. Drop in the beat, all that we need. Turn it up now, right till the morning. on to my smoothie bar and what I do is as you can see I lay everything let's see if I can get this better for you I have all my containers here I get out each of my types of fruit I've got bananas frozen blueberries frozen squash 
and I have a berry mixture with uh, spinach. And usually what I do is I don't buy them like this. When we were having the quarantine, there wasn't as many options, so I had to buy this, but usually I do it individually. Please excuse the dogs. So now what I'm gonna do is go through and just pack a box for each day. And that way, each morning, I can pull a box out, pre-made, and I just dump it in the blender, and then I have all of my smoothie uh, ingredients, powders, all that kind of stuff, additives that I put in uh, to make it as much protein and as good, all my vitamins in at one time. So, let's do it. Just love to play. Okay, so a couple things I wanted to mention about these containers. I get these containers at Walmart. They come in, I think, a set of five, and they're pretty inexpensive. But it's great for, you know, if you have like uh, a big dinner and you want to send home some leftovers for somebody, or you can just pack it up and send it with them because they're so inexpensive. And then um, also for lunches, you know, if I'm uh, having leftovers and I, want to send a, a, a lunch with my daughter. Uh, there, It's really great, but it's also great for this because I just grab out, it's the perfect for two smoothies, which is for my mom and I, and I just pull this out of the freezer and dump it and go. Uh, the, these I wanted to mention about, I got these at Costco. I don't usually buy these because they're more expensive, but it is a convenient way if you don't have a lot of time and you don't want a meal prep, for smoothies because it's just like for one smoothie this is just perfect you all you'd have to do is add whatever liquid uh, if, if protein powder if that's what you wanted or any vitamins or anything additives that you wanted uh, so they are convenient but they are a little bit more expensive because it's already pre-done but I did use it this time uh, well I'm just trying to use everything up from the freezer but also because I didn't have any spinach or uh, broccoli or anything like that of a vegetable, a green vegetable that I like to put in. So those are the two things I wanted to um, talk about. Again, this is Costco. I usually get all my frozen fruit from Costco and I just buy it and I just like I did, I line it up and just grab and, and fill in each box as I go. So uh, then what I do is I put all of these containers that I've made in the freezer here and if I'm really doing a bunch up, I have that I have them in the outside freezer so I can just pull in how many of the week I need. Uh, but I just keep them right here, you know, right with my uh, freezer and I just pull it out and it's convenient. And it, I find that if something is convenient and easier to just grab and do, I'm a lot more apt to do it than if I have to go and grab all the bags of fruit and put it in the blender and all that. I can just grab this and I can just dump it and go. So as you can see, this is what I got for the week. I got five of my containers of fruit for my smoothies. I got four and a half uh, bottles of the uh, celery juice that I put in my smoothies. This is one of the liquids I use. And then I've got all my containers of fruit. I had a little extra of the blackberries, so I put it in this cute little uh, fruit basket. I love those. Uh, so anyhow, I've got this all taken care of, and now it's cleanup time. Okay, so you can see how I've got my fruit stored. The big one is in the back, my two up here, and my little basket, which will be the first one to pull. I keep all my uh, celery juice in here, and 
then I will show you how I do my freezer. So in my freezer, here is all my uh, smoothie breakfast items, except we've got a lot of ice cream, as you can see. My mother buys it, and then I bought it. And <laughs> but this is how the freezer is separated. We have uh, smoothie, breakfast, and ice cream. Okay, my friends, so that is it. I hope I gave you some good ideas and something that can help you have your life run smoother and your mornings or just have stuff prepared. It takes about an hour, it's easy to do, and it sure does save a lot of time. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you consider subscribing, and if you subscribe, please make sure you hit the notification and all. That way you are notified. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.